who is the shakespeare of romance writers according to nathan drake well it is none other than gothic writer and redcliff born in the year 1764 she was contemporary of fanny burney who was born in the year 1752 so they were born in middle of 18th century and redcliff was a very big fan of charlotte turner smith she followed charlotte turner smith who was also a gothic writer but she had something very different in her which nobody else had and that was her style of blending terror and suspense with romance well her first two novels were published anonymously her first novel was a castle of albion and dunbay second was a sicilian romance both of them were published anonymously her third novel very famous the romance of the forest was also mentioned by jane austen's emma in which the character harriet refers to the romance of the forest to her friends next novel which all of us know is the mysteries of udelpho we can find uh, its description in northanger abbey where the heroine reads this book the mysteries of adelpho and also there is mention of the romance of the forest well the in the mysteries of adelpho we uh, see that it's a story of uh, an orphaned uh, child uh, emily who is subjected to cruelty and uh, she is threatened a lot and the way she deals with that a goofy atmosphere a goofy ambience of the castle it is all about that and one very important thing to remember is it was written in four volumes huge book isn't it the next novel the italian uh, was based on spanish inquisition well it is inspired and uh, you can say repulsed also by the monk which was written by matthew gregory lewis who was also contemporary of uh, fanny burney uh, then she has written uh, one more novel which was published posthumously uh, i mean after her death and the novel was gaston de bondeville Uh, that was all about Anne Redcliffe. Thank you for listening.